And yes, we are pulled over. get a little more active as far as traveling goes during the spring. Kind of like the bears, but not as grumpy. While we drive, let me tell you why Waze is my favorite GPS travel app. This little gold yellow dot brings me a menu. You can share information about where police and road hazards are in real time. It also has a speed indicator. You can also see that my husband is speeding right now. Oops. So it's free, it helps. And it may potentially save you, or at least my husband, a traffic ticket. Really, John? I'm just hurrying to our destination so I can spend more time with you. We're in the car together. So? We're already spending time together. So? Lots of it. In the van. Valley Country Store. I love stopping here. This is not a place that I can take Tomlin in. The reason is because the gift shop is kind of tightly packed and one swish of his super friendly tail and he is just cleaned off shells. When we have to go in and leave him, we limit it to a timed 15 minutes and make sure he has water and fans on inside the van. Leaving him on a hot day is non-negotiable. No way. Is that okay? Oh yeah, it's fine. Okay. Yeah, we've stopped. We stopped we here every it. time we come through town. Come to towns and yeah, yeah, we're uh, redoing the whole store. Really? So yeah, we're remapping the whole thing. Look here, who thinks he's driving? Hey, you. Did you wonder where we went? Townsend calls itself the quieter side with Smokies. The handful of businesses include a couple of tourist stops, a grocery store, the place we just left, and the KOA campground, which is where we're heading now. Smoky Mountains National Park, Great Smoky Mountains Heritage Center, Cades Cove. But first, we have to get the campsite. Cades Cove is where we're going. That's the number one most visited portion of the most visited park in the U.S. The Great Smoky Mountains has no entrance fees and lots of really neat opportunities to do whitewater rafting, kayaking, hiking, fishing, Pretty much whatever you can think of. Uh, but it's also close to Pigeon Forge and Gatlinburg. So it's close to really great shopping and lots of restaurants and just really neat things. It's about an hour outside of Knoxville. So we're going to be at the KOA here in Townsend. Right now. Which is? Yeah. My husband and I. We really like taking advantage of off-season travel. It's still a warm day, still plenty to see, just not as crowded. The rates are a little bit lower, but sometimes you don't have quite the amenities. Like over here behind us, they've got a few of the picnic tables put up, but we still have plenty of picnic tables at our campsite. Something that is gonna be pretty important to a lot of the people that come is their cell phone service. I'm getting two bars of signal 
This is Straight Talk. Now it piggybacks off of Verizon Towers here. Some Straight Talk piggybacks off of AT&T. That signal is here at the KOA in Townsend Campground. Other parts, like we're fixing to go to Cades Cove and they don't have any cell phone service at all. Pigeon Forge has got great cell phone service. That's on the other side. It's a little more boisterous. We just want a quiet overnight place to relax. Townsend is perfect for what we want this time. Off to our camping spot. We're right here. Just a couple of miles from the Case Cove Loop and Campground, aren't we? Yeah, it's seven miles. Not bad. I didn't realize we were that close. We're heading to the Case Cove Loop Road. This is an 11 mile one way loop. It takes at minimum two hours to drive it. It can take four or five depending on traffic and wildlife. There is a picnic area right before you go onto the parking lot for the Cades Cove Loop Road. Inside the park are stables, historic buildings, and the facilities are halfway down the loop at the cable mill area. Now this is the Dan Lawson place. You'll see other historic buildings like this in the park along with some churches and even some grasslands that are being restarted. And some sites like these. Keep your camera charged and at the ready. You may see bear, deer, or other wildlife in the cove. And this is the Carter Shields cabin. Pay attention to all traffic laws in the park. We were lucky and got a warning. It's better to play it safe than risk having your wife mad at you. Have a good evening. Thank you too. Thank you. Thanks. You want a drink? Yes, Lord.